Here I'm going to discuss about how to run Django in PyCharm. So first you're opening the command prompt and there I'm going to show you the Python. So writing your Python, then you can get your Python that already installed. This is the version. The next is you need to open the PyCharms. So this is the latest version. You can use professional or community and uh, you need to create the project first so creating the new project of uh, Django and uh, here selecting Django so let's uh, give here project name item after that uh, here automatically python exe file that's taken no need to change anything click on this create so this window so here this is creating the project of uh, Zango with the name Adam here you can see reloading and the project is created then after here clicking on the project here Adam inside Adam you can see this all files this is the managed PI the next thing is here if I go on this file setting and if I go on this so project Adam Python interpreter so here you can see Django is there this is the version so if that install that's fine if that not installed click on this plus there you need to write here Django. Then you can get this one Django. This uh, information is there. Or uh, high level Python web development, the framework in colors. So this uh, you need to install part. It's already is there. So okay. So if that not uh, available, then you can click on this install. So this is successfully installed. Okay. After that, click on this close. Okay. Now the next is here. You need to create the one file. Right click, then this place or uh, selecting here Python file, giving the name views.py. So inside views.py, you need to write the code. So this code, there I'm going to paint the hello world. So before all that, I want to check uh, Zango is running or not. So here Python interpreter and this place writing here Python manage.py. Sorry, Django is uh, with the help of this, we can easily analyze Django is working correctly or not. So Django is successfully working, there is no any problem. Now after that, views.py, you need to write this code. Then I'm trying to print the hello world. Save that. Then go to URS, select this all, remove. And insert there, you need to write this code. From this place. pasting there and uh, project name is now Adam so you need to give the meaningful project name and here now you can see from Adam import views okay so that's done here control s to save whatever the added changes that's come there okay got it now you don't need to change anything click on this run and here run item then you can get here uh, this uh, run then click on this browser and here you can see hello world it's a display if you do any changes on the views.py hello world blah 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 how are you control s to save 
so this is so uh, views dot changed reloading kind of message you are you are getting here then after uh, if I click here on the run item stop and rerun I click on this then you can see hello world how are you it's satisfied so this is how very simple way we can run the Django project inside uh, PyCharms so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now this video is over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you